is Sky Bree. I'm 23 years old and I am an OnlyFans model and I just recently started Twitch. Arby, so what kind of guy are you looking for? So I don't really have a type. I feel like every dude I've ever dated is completely different from the next, but mostly I look for a good sense of humor, someone who can make me laugh. I love a gentleman. He has to be sweet and be nice to my mom. He has to impress my mom. <laughs> Mom, let's get in here. <laughs> Yay! Yay! Oh, oh my God, first off, are you sure this isn't your sister? Do we look alike? Do you see it? It's the eyes, isn't it? No, yeah, and <laughs> everything else. It's so beautiful. All right, let's bring out the boys. One of these guys is going to be the love of your life. I'm excited. Oh, they're playing Tootsie over there. They're secure with their sexuality. I think that's okay. what it is. I like that. Okay, so I do OnlyFans. Would you be down to have a threesome? And if so, which celebrity would you pick to be in the threesome? All right, contestant number one. What do we think about this guy's feet? They're a little hairy. Mom, what do you um, think? You like hair? On the feet, it's okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it honestly looks like he could clip his toenails a little bit better, Ooh. but okay. um, not too bad, honestly. Yeah, a little. His hygiene could be a little better, but yeah. not too bad. Okay, contestant number one. Um, yeah. So I would, I would pick Steve Harvey. Um, <laughs> I think, I think when he says good answer, that would just, you know, enhance our experience together. Wow. Okay. Great answer. That's good. I've never watched Family Feud, to be honest. I haven't so either. I know who he is, but I don't know too much about him. You'd be laughing the whole time. At least you won mom's vote, which is good. Okay. <laughs> that means a lot to me that you won yeah. my mom's vote. But so. that's all you would notice. You'd be laughing the whole time. You said you wanted a funny guy. Yeah, well, I did. Maybe he's not funny, but at least his partner is. I did. <laughs> All right, contestant number two, what do we think? A little concerning, we don't know if he's tall. What if he's like six feet and he just has small feet? I'd give him a chance. Okay, that's good. I like the element of surprise. Would you be down to have a threesome and which celebrity would you pick to be in the threesome? Uh, three, threesome, whoa, that, that's a lot of bodies. Um, <laughs> but... I'd probably pick Jackie Chan. He's like the type of guy to do all his stunts, so I feel like he could just do everything for me and I, I could just maybe watch. Contestant number three, well, how are we feeling? Can you step forward a little bit? They look pretty big. I, yeah. They look huge, not gonna lie. Would you be down to have a threesome? And if so, which celebrity would you pick to be in it? You know, potentially Ryan Reynolds. Oh. I've been trying to get in yes. touch with him for a while. Yes. And he hasn't returned any of my calls, but I think combined, you and I could do a lot of damage. I don't know if anybody would say no to the both of us. We should shoot big and we should go for Ryan Reynolds. Mm. I like the confidence. I wouldn't be caught dead trying to have sex with Ryan Reynolds because he would just make me look bad. Right, so, so that's why I ex I respect the confidence. Because that's number uh, four. Down for a threesome. They always say you need to think of your grandma to not come quick. I don't think that's enough for you, so I actually need a grandma in the room. I'm gonna pick Betty White. She's dead. Oh, nice. Wait, she's Betty dead. Will, she's dead? <laughs> oh yeah, Be Betty White is dead. Super dead, super dead. Uh, like, but you didn't say they, they uh, had to be alive. Okay, I'll take so. the queen. She's dead. <laughs> she's dead she's, the Wait. queen is also dead. <laughs> she's also dead. <laughs> They're all dead. Every old woman is dead. What, what happened? He likes dead women. Maybe he was into necrophilia. <laughs> oh my god. No, I definitely need a grandma in the room to help me not come too quick. I think his heart was right in the right place because he didn't want to. You don't want to bust quick. I understand where he's coming from totally, but when he said that, I pictured my own grandmother in the room, which is slightly disturbing. What does she look like? <laughs> First off, if this is what your mom looks like, if she I'm looks as good go. as your mom, yeah, well, foursome. Okay. All right. He's out. The, the rest of them are gonna have to <laughs> fuck shit up for you to stay. <laughs> oh, oh, are we on number five? Yeah, five? Okay. I mean, look, if we're gonna have a threesome, I'd rather be with someone respectable. Uh, I pick Michelle Obama. I mean, yeah. what better collab than the first lady and my first lady? Wow. You know? Okay. Wow. And, and, and considering how much she's done for women all around the world, I mean, you could only imagine wow. The type Dude. of things she could do to one. I like how he thinks. He's a thinker. He's a thinker. All right, contestant number six. I'd be I'd be down to have a threesome, but uh, I definitely couldn't have it with somebody better looking than me because I feel like I don't want to lose too much of your attention. So I'm gonna have to go with Danny DeVito. Danny DeVito, honestly, one of the funniest guys ever. Oh yeah. Hilarious. All right, contestant number seven. Yeah, let's get it. <laughs> Can you move up for a little bit? Yeah, forward? I got you. <laughs> would you be down to have a threesome with me? And if so, which celebrity would you pick to be no in it? No fucking way, dude. 
just you and me. We're talking missionary. The one where I'm on top of you. <laughs> missionary again. No, it's gonna be like the most like okay time of your life. Your friends will be like, how was it? You're like, he's all right. So... No, I'm down, I'm down too. Let's throw like Ezra Miller in there. Let's have like this <laughs> psychopath vibe type shit. Let's make it soft. This? Let's make it interesting. He's the winner. He's the winner. Yes. All I needed on. was. What happened to the other guy? Mom, touch the feet. Are there other guys here? <laughs> you mentioned missionary. Missionary yeah, yeah, yeah. is the actually one my favorite position. Me too. I want to look in the uh -huh. eyes. Oh my god, me too. I want to look you the in the best. eyes. It's so, it's so good. You know, you get the best of both worlds. I bring right. like a type of like I love you vibe to like the first time type shit. That's perfect. Yeah. Cause I like making love. Yeah, me too. I'm the love maker, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, that was pretty ick. Contestant number eight. I think I just am very pale, so my feet look very dead. At least he's not dead on the inside. Hopefully. Would you be down to have a threesome with me? And if so, which celebrity would you pick to be in the threesome? Uh, I'd be down to have a threesome. I probably want somebody like a big presence in there. So either Vin Diesel or Peter Dinklage. <laughs> <laughs> Who's Peter Dinklage? He's a funny guy. He's a good actor. Oh my God, he's my favorite one in Game of Thrones. Yeah, he's okay. fun. That's why he okay. said he wanted a big presence because he, okay, he, he can he made Game of Thrones. You know? He did for sure. He was yeah, my favorite character. Yeah. Okay. I don't know. Jon Snow made Game of okay, Thrones. Okay, he's the hottest for sure. Okay, but. okay definitely. Mom likes Jon Snow. Yeah. I am going to be eliminating the contestant that said Danny DeVito. Oh. Nick. What's up, but I was gonna win because of the tone. <laughs> it's gonna meet you. Hi, great to meet you. It's gonna meet you, Mama Sky. Thank you. <laughs> All right, so guys, <laughs> so first thoughts? Um, one of them's really sticking out. The guy with the tattoos, am I right? Is that the one? <laughs> it might be the one wearing hot pink. I knew I loved him. See, okay. I told you, small feet, but he's packing. Okay. I think. I wonder if he's nervous to get a boner. Sure, what would you I got? think we're all nervous <laughs> to get a boner. Let it's not cook. gonna work. The one on the end, Loki, kind of looks like he does. I look like I have a. No, I don't. <laughs> you kind of do. It's sticking out a little it bit. Is, you see what I'm talking about? I see about? what you're talking about. <laughs> yeah, he looks like he's packing. Yeah, you. Thank you for redeeming me a little bit. Okay, so contestants, I am a big kisser. So I want you to describe what kissing you would be like using a song title. I'm gonna go Way Too Sexy by Drake. Us kissing would be just, you know, way too sexy for anyone to handle. I do love Drake. Contestant number two, how would you describe your kissing using the title of a song? Oh, uh, it'd probably be like, Don't Stop Believing. Like, cause when we kiss, like, I, I'll be in so much shock cause I, I've never kissed. I mean, I've kissed so many girls uh, before. Contestant number three. It looks like he has pretty strong legs, like he's athletic. Yeah. You, you have know? really soft legs. Would you describe your kissing like using the title of a song? I think I'm gonna go with Sparks Fly by Taylor Swift, Big Swifty. <laughs> and um, Big Swifty. But I figure, you know, that could describe the moment between us, Sparks Fly. Wow, it's beautiful. Thanks, David. Honestly, I like that. Recently, I've been saying to my friends that I'm waiting to find a spark oh. with the guys that I'm talking with, so I do... Let's go. I do like that one, okay. All right, what do you mean? Contestant number four, he's got tats, he's got some bling on. I love the tats. I like the tats, too. Mm -hmm. I also I, like I the like the jewelry, I like yes. the rings and the bracelet, yeah. Mom's loving yeah. contestant number four. If I had to pick a song for our kiss, it would be Drake Fireworks, because self-explanatory, it's just gonna be fireworks. Can you sing a little bit of that song for me? <clears throat> Every night there's fireworks, fireworks. <laughs> It's kind of cute how he was a little bit shy to sing that. Yeah. I liked that. No, but he did it. He, he did like, it. Went yeah. right in and did yeah. it. He I'll did. do anything for you. Wow. Basically. Cool. That's super He'd sweet. do anything for me. Wow. Anything. All right, uh, contestant number five. We'll be feeling he's got some red strings. If you had to describe kissing you, how would you describe it using a song title? Uh, I just had sex featuring Akon, because, like, basically, oh, yeah. I love that song. That's a good song. Yeah, I actually play that song every single time I'm done having sex. Really? Yeah, my girlfriend loves it. I'm gonna have to take that, I'm gonna have to start you doing should, that. You should do that. Okay, yeah. okay. Contestant number six, if you had to describe kissing you, how would you describe it using the title of a song? You said you like, you like Drake. I do. It's crazy, I'm like really close with him and shit. <laughs> I love sicko mode. <laughs> After we're done, it'll be like, bam! <laughs> Fuck man, I'm gonna look back at this in two weeks and hate myself. <laughs>
Okay, contestant number seven, if you had to describe kissing you using a song title, what would it be? This is an easy one, probably turn my swag on. Swag on. That's definitely a unique answer. So you kiss her and then she's thinking, turn my swag on. <laughs> yeah, basically. Okay. A little, little different. <laughs> The first contestant I am eliminating is contestant number one. Why? He was a little dry. Yeah, I it felt just that didn't, too. It just, he just didn't do it for me. Oh, look at this stud though. Oh, he's cute. Yeah, he's cute. He's very cute. It wasn't my choice oh, to it's, get rid it's of him. Right. It's all right, it's all right. Hi. I'm Jonah. Nice to meet nice you. Nice to meet you. Oh, we'll, we'll that's my foot. Yeah. I was just nervous, I was nervous, of course. No, that's okay. But you look, you look gorgeous and I hope y'all Y'all got some good guys back there, so Thank you. don't even worry about it. Appreciate Love it. Love you, dude. Oh. Love you. He was cute. Okay, the next contestant I am eliminating is contestant number five. Bye. He's cute. Hi. That's all good. Hi. Hi. Do we hug? Nice to meet you. Yeah. Hi. Hi. Sorry, Vlad. Oh, he smelled good. He See won last time, too. I did win last time. Oh. Trying to get that two peat. He was kind of dry. So, contestants, if you had to describe your sex life using the title of a movie, what would it be? All right, contestant number one. Probably be like the movie Castaway with uh, Tom Hanks. <laughs> you know, he's surrounded by all these fish around him in an island by himself. Contestant number two has really fucking nice abs. Thank you. How would you describe your sex life using the title of a movie? Lately, it's been, uh, it's been Home Alone. Um, Bro. <laughs> but every once in a while, when things go my way, it's deep impact. Okay. I like that. Yeah. Honestly, I like that because I can relate to that. Recently, I've been really low key. I haven't been. Same. In too many people. All right, uh, contestant number three. He's got, man, he's got so many abs. If I described my sex life, it would probably be holes uh, because I like to explore all my partner's holes. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Boom. Okay. You like that one. Okay. Let's go. I've had many of my holes explored. Oh, so I like, wow. I like wow. that. That's number four. Whiplash. Boom. Victory screech. Thank you for playing. <laughs> did, you, did you like it? So he, so do you like to whip people? Do you like your No, spanking? it's like I'm going to do it so hard your fucking back is going to be like blown out. God. No. I thought it was like you guys would get it. It's, it, it'll be it. Again, it'll, it's just all right. I think I've gotten whiplash. Really? From some of my I'd love to learn more about that later. Okay, contestant number five. If you had to describe your sex life using the title of a movie, what would it be? <sighs> I'd probably say The Incredible Hulk. Because you want to smash me? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, because Hulk smashed. Oh. See, he's smiling in the abs. They yeah. get like more defined. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> First contestant I will be eliminating is contestant number one. The next person I will be eliminating is contestant number five. Hey, bud. Hello. Hi. Hey, guys. Hi. I'm Carrington. Hi, He's Carrington. Super cute. Nice to meet you both. Well, hey, bud, what happened? He was packing and stuff. It's Think because I couldn't see the eyes, honestly. Right. Yeah, look at that smile. Look at those dimples, too. Darn it. Uh, David. All right, thanks, y'all. Goodbye. Okay, the question is, what makes you someone fun to date? Contestant number one. I think I'm really spontaneous. Like this afternoon, if I wasn't doing this video, I was gonna be on a plane to Hawaii with my roommate who decided to go very last minute, but David had gotten me to do this uh, drunkenly at his birthday four days ago. So. I did, I kind of okay. snagged him on there. I was like, come on, it's my birthday. He I like no. that. I, I mean, like that. he passed up Hawaii. Yeah. For you. Oh. I would be in Hawaii right now, but I'm here, and uh, we can go to Hawaii next week. Okay. Oh, let's driving. Go. <laughs> okay. Contestant number two. Not a flex. My dad flies private jets, so you pick a place, we go easy. Oh, brother. We can spin the globe. Point Not a flex says the biggest yeah, flex afterwards big flex. ever. Who cares? I think she's hornier than me. I kind of like that, you know, but, you know, he does have to call dad for that flex, though. Right. Mile High Club, though. Think about that. Okay. That's different footage. The numbers <laughs> are going up. I've never done that personally, have you? I haven't, no. Sky, try something new. That's the title? Clickbait. <laughs> I mean, we can get it. Sky in the sky. <laughs> <laughs> write that down, write that down. That's the number three. What do we think about him? Yeah, He's... I might not have the abs or the jet or a lot of money, 
or I owe the government. You know what I do have? Like an okay, it's like a good size. It's all right, like my penis, but. He's not really too special when it comes to the arms and yeah. the chest <laughs> department. David. Really? Really? <laughs> really? All right, we're gonna have to eliminate one. We'll yeah, it, just... it's me. <laughs> <laughs> I will be eliminating contestant number one. <gasps> no way! It's Jay! Hi. You get it. Hi, Mom. Hi. How are you? Hi, I'm Hi. Jay. Hi, nice to meet nice you. Nice to meet you. Well, he smells good. Damn, what did you think about the stud? Did the face match the body, Mom? Yes. He has a really uh -huh. cute face. Yes. Yes. All right. It's not a loss. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm at a loss of words right here with this shirt off, bud. Mm -hmm. Did I win you? Yeah. That's what matters. The last question is, What's a kink you're into? I'm very kinky, just gonna say that. Sorry, mom. I don't know if it's a kink. I like to have sex in random places. Like if we're at a restaurant, you, you give me the look, meet me in the bathroom, let's make it happen. Like the bed is cool, but like, I like it. Spice okay. it up. I like switching it up too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like switching up from like my side of the bed to like her side of the bed. <laughs> it is a good time. Six Flags. Six Flags? Six On a flag. roller coaster? Ferris wheel. You know when it gets stuck at the top for too long? Yeah. While we're here. <laughs> okay. All right, contestant number two. What is your biggest kink? Um, I don't know. Like positive affirmations or something? <laughs> <laughs> No, see, this one's kind of weird for me, right? Like, f***ing butter me up, f***ing sh shove it through, f***ing put apple in my mouth, spin me like a chicken. I don't care. I'm down to, like, explore shit. Um, the contestant that I will be eliminating is contestant number one. No! Oh! Let's go! Oh! Do you believe? We got Marcus. Oh, look at this stud. No, I'm the mom. Thank you. Oh, they said a 20 year old model. Oh! Figured that was you. Oh my god. Oh my god. Let's go. You must be mom. Hi. <laughs> Marcus. Hi. Nice to meet you. You said you like Drake. It's like great value if you. Oh my god, that's true. <laughs> Maybe. Hit me up. Oh, he's cute. Five he's really five. cute. Am I good? Yeah, come out, contestant number one. <laughs> Miss Johnson, third grade, said I wouldn't be shit. <laughs> you, Miss Johnson. Mama, how are ya? Hey. Hi. Hi. How are you? <laughs> hey. We can, get, we can kiss if you want. Yeah, come here. <laughs> that, my dad is gonna say that. It's fine. Uh, yeah, guys, let's go. <laughs> I feel like she made the right decision. She saw a boss. She went for a boss, you know? 